At this point, we spent over three hours tearing down, discussing, and inspecting a very popular heavy-duty Ford transmission. Now it's time to check out the new parts we'll be using as we move forward during the reassembly. I'm glad you're still with me. This is Ford E4OD 4R100 class, lesson nine. This lesson will not only reintroduce you to the contents of a high quality overhaul kit, but also go over the other necessary ingredients you will need to thoroughly overhaul the transmission. And for those of you interested in the optional modified high performance version, we'll take another look at the Transgo high performance reprogramming kit we will be installing during this project. All of the products we're about to go over, as well as any of the items we inspected and discussed in earlier lessons, are available online 24 hours a day at the transmissionbench.com store. If you're not sure of what you need or you're looking for a part not listed on the website, please give us a call during business hours by using the phone number listed on our contact page. Now let's look at the new parts. Even though I mentioned these new products in lesson one, I want to review and discuss them again because this is the logical point in the project to order what you need. At a minimum, you will need two products in order to follow along with the remaining lessons. You'll need to purchase a deluxe super kit and a solenoid pack. A third item, the Transgo reprogramming kit, is optional. Let's take a closer look at the two things you must have. First, you'll need the Deluxe Super Kit. It's a fundamental minimum package of replacement parts, but not necessarily every part you will need in order to overhaul this transmission. There are two kits to choose from depending upon the vehicle model year. The 1996 through 2005 kit seen here, for example, contains the following. A master overhaul kit, superior shift correction kit, intermediate heavy duty sprag assembly, a Sonax brand replacement snap ring for the overdrive piston, as well as pump, sun gear, and extension housing bushings and two-wheel and four-wheel drive type filters. You'll also get a new intermediate band, intermediate servo assembly, and bonded piston set. Let's take a closer look. The master overhaul portion of the Deluxe Super Kit contains all the O-rings, D-rings, metal clad seals, lip seals, paper gaskets, ceiling rings, as well as an assortment of other small parts, such as small filters, ceiling washers, and even new check balls. Many of the parts are thoughtfully sub-packaged and labeled for easy identification. You also get data sheets with extremely useful information such as updates, bolt torque specification, and even check ball locations. The same information is in Spanish on the back of each page. The master overhaul kit portion also includes all of the friction and steel plates used in the various clutch packs. The Superior brand shift correction kit is a very important part of the kit and our project. I personally cannot imagine rebuilding this transmission without using this product. Let's take a look at what's in it. Along with detailed instructions, you get, first of all, a new booster valve and sleeve assembly for the pressure regulator bore. 
This is a part known to wear badly and should always be replaced. A new pressure regulator spring is also included. There is an assortment of accumulator springs which you can optionally install for firmer shifts. Especially important is a replacement drain back valve which goes into the stator support of the pump. An assortment of small drill bits is supplied to modify the size of various passages in the pump. Again, I always install this kit into every E40D4100 I work on and I recommend that you should too. Both two and four wheel drive filters are in this particular kit. It can be confusing to know which one to purchase since even some two wheel drive versions actually have a deep pan requiring a four wheel drive type filter. The 1996-2-2005 kit comes with both. A new intermediate band and new intermediate servo assembly are part of this kit. Finally, in this particular kit, a full set of bonded rubber on steel pistons are included. Four replacement bushings come in this kit. The pump, extension housing, and the two bushings in the sun gear are the ones which you most likely, but not necessarily may, find to be worn. They're in the kit if you need them. The intermediate sprag assembly should never be reused. You get a new one. Finally, the kit includes a unique solution to an old persistent problem in this transmission. You get a Sonex brand spiral type replacement snap ring for the overdrive clutch piston return spring. The original type snap ring just will not stay in its groove in the housing. This new part permanently fixes the problem. The Deluxe Super Kit is a great foundation for rebuilding this transmission and there are two to choose from at the transmissionbench.com store depending upon which year model you're working on. One kit covers years 1989 through 1995. The other one covers 1996 through 2005, but you will need something else to complete the recipe, electronics. All five solenoids which control this transmission are contained inside one large housing. It's called the solenoid pack and it should always be replaced. There are three different ones to choose from depending upon the transmission model year and if you have a gas or diesel engine. I strongly encourage you to buy a new one, but if you are on a limited budget, remanufactured ones are available at a lower cost. Like the Deluxe Super Kit, the solenoid packs are available at the transmissionbench.com store. The Deluxe Super Kit, along with a new solenoid pack, will cover the basic ingredients you'll need for a light new E40D4100. But if you want to go to another performance level, there is one more product you may want. If you want to reach for the highest performance level possible with this transmission, this is the kit to get you there. This is the Transgo. HP2 Tugger reprogramming kit. It contains parts and instructions for modifying not only the valve body, but also other areas of the transmission drivetrain too. The result is a very fast and extremely firm shifting transmission with a lot more manual control. We will thoroughly cover the installation of this kit during this video classroom. It's also available from the transmissionbench.com store. Let's open the box and take a closer look. Inside you'll find, first of all, information such as the very detailed instructions, updates, and of course, a sticker. You'll also get two updated snap rings. 
one for the coast clutch, and another for the fourth clutch piston return spring. This is called the accumulator body calibration plate. It works along with the color-coded springs and a spool valve in this bag to make the shifts much firmer. This bag has springs, a quick fill valve, end plug, and clip which go in the valve body. These bags contain replacement components for the pressure regulator assembly in the pump. The sleeve bushing, valve, and springs in this package will make shifting into reverse and manual low much firmer and quicker. Finally, the contents of this bag include the main, much stiffer, orange-colored pressure regulator spring, special direct clutch piston lip seal, EPC check valve and spring, and a stiff yellow-colored spring for the converter regulator valve. There is also a drill bit for enlarging holes in the separator plate. If your vehicle is used in competitive events like drag racing, sled pulling, mud bogging, rock climbing, or occasional street action, this is the kit you want to install in the transmission. It is item number T36169EA and available on the Transmission Bench store page. Installation of the High Performance Transgo kit will be a popular option during the course of this project, but it is not mandatory. In other words, I will show you how to reassemble the transmission to its normal stock, mild shifting, but still heavy duty configuration too. That's about it for Lesson 9 and our shopping trip for new parts. When your deluxe super kit solenoid pack, and maybe the Transgo kit arrive, meet me in Lesson 10, and we'll finally begin to build an incredibly tough E40D 4R100 transmission you'll be proud of.